Hello everyone and welcome back to HK Kiss mini tutorial. Uh, this one will uh, teach you how to install the uh, Japanese hardware into an English OX, uh, OS. This is XP. Um, it's, uh, if you have any Japanese hardware, you'll notice that there is some incompatibilities with the keys on the keyboard. Uh, so let's just change that. First of all, what you have to do is let's go into the control panel and we will look into the uh, printers and into the hardware and you can go into your keyboard and let's click on the hardware and right away you'll have the standard 101 102 key board and that's not uh, compatible with the japanese style keyboard so you can click on the uh, properties and let's just click on driver and update the driver so I'll click on update driver and at this time we don't want it to look for uh, the, the hardware we know where it is so click on no not this time and install from a list of specific location uh, the Japanese keyboard is actually a default Windows uh, driver oh, did I say install from a specific there we go sorry about that don't search I will choose a driver to install there we are. And show compatible hardware. Uh, Japanese style keyboards aren't compatible, but if you have a disc from your manufacturer with a Japanese uh, uh, for the Japanese keyboard, that's fine. You can click on Have Disc right here and install it. Uh, if you don't, uh, normally the keyboards don't come with drivers, and it's a hell of a thing to try to find one on the internet. So just go into your Japanese. PS2 keyboard 106 109 keyboard under standard keyboards and that'll work just fine so click on next now this will tell you that uh, it's not compatible uh, it will be compatible but if you do have some uh, extra functions on your keyboard such as the, uh, the volume up volume down uh, music things like that uh, it may not uh, work too well but the uh, keyboard itself will work just wonderfully so we'll just click on yes for that uh, if you don't have the proper drivers for your keyboard and uh, this also so it's uh, warns you about incompatibility incompatibility or conflict with your PS2 mouse port um, chances are either your PS2 your your mouse or your keyboard are using USB so uh, and even so there's not going to be a, uh, incompatible with your PS2 port just on very very old systems so I'll just accept that as yes and it'll copy the files over and this will uh, if, if it asks for your Windows CD it may ask for your Windows CD so just install your Windows CD or put it in your CD ROM player and wait for a second and while this is waiting I'll just bring up notepad so we can see if it works okay may not work just well it will work right now but uh, that'll put the uh, at sign on top of the two yeah still not working properly so we have a few more steps to do so uh, the at sign is still on top of the two and there's a number of other incompatibilities as well here so I'll just wait for it to finish here I'll see if I can pause it okay so now that we have the uh, keyboard all set up let's get back into the language the input method so uh, click on date time language and regional options and regional and language options let's click on that and right now we have to click on language and install files for East Asian languages let's just look that one okay yes that's fine we want to do that and so hit apply It may ask again. I may ask again for your CD. Windows XP CD. And let's just pause this. It may take a little while. Oh, it's actually going pretty fast. Uh, you might want to restart it. Let's just see. Yeah, it would be a good idea to restart it. And once you restart it, uh, 
uh, just select the uh, details option and uh, you, well, you won't have Japanese there yet you just uh, select down this list and you, all you'll have is an English uh, availability so then select add and look down the list and now you will have the Japanese availability there so we'll click on Japanese and click on OK so it'll come up right there IME standard and the Microsoft natural import so uh, let's select uh, the Japanese IME as the import method is the uh, standard import method and then on the advanced as well everything is fine here turn off advanced text services that would be okay make sure that's turned off and uh, to restart now yeah you'd want to restart now as well so when you come back uh, go back into your control panel and go back into the uh, date time language and regional options and again regional and language options here and back into advanced and then just select the uh, Japanese as you put method here ah, sorry All right. there we go and select that as, as default don't be messing with that and everything else should be just fine we've got that we've got the details that's all selected okay and now you want to restart one final time and everything should be just fine